We're here with Paul Wickert. Paul is our team leader for our Slovakia teams the last five summers. And so, Paul, uh, share with uh, the folks what a team can expect. Uh, well, starting last summer, uh, our camp for junior high age kids, which we call J Camp, was integrated with the last week of their regular school term. Uh, we try and build on the same theme that they're using in their uh, school the entire year. Last year was God My Rock, and this year is the Visible Word. Uh, we develop a four-part program based on that theme, with, which involves a lesson in the theme, arts and crafts tied to the theme, some English enrichments with using games uh, and, and the theme, and some good old fun sports to do. Uh, often uh, we use our, our camp to do community outreach, both locally and sometimes specifically like the gypsy community that they have in Martin. Cool. So, uh, as you can tell, uh, we've been at work in Slovakia for a few years, and Tomáš Gulan, who is one of, he's, what, our handler? Yes, uh, you so might to say. speak. Uh, he had some words to say about the impact that our teams have been having uh, the past several summers. Dear friends and friends to be, uh, first of all, let me cordially thank you for all the wonderful ministry that Hales Corners Lutheran Church has done. Now the impact that I, I see that happening is that, uh, first of all, it's um, building bridges with the, the community. Uh, quite often the kids, because of their families and the family backgrounds, have some church affiliates, but it's very traditional or very low on, on the frequency level. So the families might worship a few times a year, but not attend the, uh, the, the worship service regularly. And so having a, an opportunity to, to share the gospel pretty much five days a week for a number of hours a day is an excellent opportunity to impact the children, especially in the difficult time when they are making their life-changing decisions or deciding whether they are going to become an active believer or faith is just going to be just as it has been in their families, meaning not really a active integral part of their life. So uh, the impact is predominantly where I see it is uh, that um, we have a chance to touch the hearts of these young people and through these young people also reach their families. So uh, you've heard from uh, Tomas what our teams have been doing on the ground and the impact that they've been having. Uh, Paul, how has serving in this way impacted you in your own faith walk? Well, my wife Pat and I have grown very close to many of the people, not only at the school, but in, the, in, in these countries. We've developed very close relationships, and being able to share our faith with them has been uh, the high point of our last eight, ten summers. So if you want to head over the summer, Paul, when are you going again? Uh, we'll be leaving on June 20th, and the team should be back on the 30th. So that's the time frame. Uh, the accommodations and the food are great, so come on along. Yep, and if you want more information, you can contact uh, me, Pastor Wood, or you can contact Jessica Ramdor in the church office. Have a great day, and we look forward to uh, meeting you this summer. Indeed, thank you.